Hi everyone, thanks for stopping by. Liz here, just going to share with you my new parcel that's just arrived today. And this one is from Craft Saving. So let's have a look and see what we've got. See what this one is. It feels very flat, so I think this is a special drill or a partial again. So let's have a look. Okay, oh wow. Oh, look at those blue eyes. That is gorgeous. Oh, I love that. What a stunning face that has. Oh yeah. So I've wanted this one for quite a while. Um, you can get it in a full drill, but I, I love this as the special drill one. It literally has, it's going to have the gems and the drills all over the face. Um, more or less covering the canvas. It says it's 25 by 30, but I would expect that that is the actual size of the canvas, not just the picture. So let's have a look. So this one is, yeah, it's a 25 that way instead of 30. So you're losing that little bit for the canvas edges by a 20. So it's a 25 by 20, but it's a great picture. I do love that. It's going to be lovely to do. Let's have a look at those drills. You do get your basic tool kit as well. This one again, um, it's like a good starter kit, bag, uh, sorry, a boat, wax and your drill pen. So let's have a look at these. Oh, look at these colours. There's actually only five colours in this. Can you see that there? Five colours. Wow. That would be a nice quick one to do. So look at those, that's like a fire orange colour. That's great. And then we've got a red. I assume that's like the, the little nose area down here. Got your silver, there's a lot of silver there. That'll be for his whiskers and all his white parts are going to be silver. This is going to sparkle so much. And then your black, which is just your normal resin drills. And that's for your stripes in him. And then another amber orange is there to complement those two together are going to look great, look at those, wow, I do love tigers, uh, in Hull City our, the nickname for our soccer football team is the tigers, so we do tend to have quite a bit of uh, tiger stuff around the city, but uh, this is lovely, it's not going to be too heavy either, so I may even make that one into a card, you never know, so watch this space, I do like to experiment with things and not just have them as pictures on walls. Um, may do something else with that one. See, so watch this space. But yeah, that is absolutely. Ah, oh, look at those. That needs to get sorted every single time I get. I want to do it now. Not than a thousand a day. Okay, let's get on to the next one. And I have to say, note to self. Please read sizes and think about what you're ordering before you get it. Because this is a 40 by 30. And I just had this mad idea that this was going to go on the wall in my bedroom and look like a window. Uh, no, Liz, not at this size. It's not. You need it an awful lot bigger. But it's still a good canvas and it's still a good picture. And I'm still going to do it. So let's get into it and have a look. Oh, and the drills are in baggies. Yay! Oh, wow, look at the toolkit on this one. Hey, look at that. This isn't a starter toolkit. This is wonderful. Hey, let's get these out and have a look. Wow, this is a really good toolkit to come with this one. Okay. All right, so, oh, you've got these, these spiky tweezers, which are really, really sharp, which is why they come with their own little cover there. But yeah, they're really good heavyweight tweezer. Oh, I like them. We're using them. We've got uh, a pen there with one of the little um, grips on it, uh, squishy as people call them. You've got a single placer at that side, but then you've got a nice, that's a three placer at that end. So that's good. What I've been doing with these as well is actually putting sparkly drills in them. Just makes them a little bit more fun when you're using them. Uh, and just makes them a little bit different. You could put different colours in for different people if you get your favourite pen that you like. Oh, and then we've got, now then, I think that's possibly, if that's a three, three, six, do we think maybe a seven? Maybe a seven, three, six, 
Ooh, maybe a bit bigger, maybe a 10. I'll have to measure these out. But yeah, that's another place. So if you're wanting to pick up lots of drills at once, which this colour has an awful lot of colour blocking on it, then yeah, I think I'm probably going to need that one. Okay, we've got a larger white book, which has some really good high sides on that, which is good. So when you're shaking, they're not all going to jump out all over. I don't know if you have that problem. I certainly do. And then four squares of wax. So that's good. So they're expecting us to use a lot. Okay, so that's that exciting bit out of the way. And it's coming back easily if it's already backed up. So you could just literally get straight on with this. If you didn't want to put them in containers, you could just work straight from the banks. Okay, so just bear with me a second. I'll just find some scissors and uh, get into this canvas because it's well and truly sealed. And this one has come on a foam roller as well. in this size <laughs> expecting it to be like window size oh dear note to self don't do that <laughs> let's just uh, get that side tape off there okay stick it in there Keep the rubbish oh get off get off wanting to stay with me okay and this one is actually a pop, uh, sorry a double sided tape as well so let's just be careful and just flatten it out a little bit for its uh, oh and it's all in strips oh dear it's not great disappointment always around but i ought to read things better before i do them okay so we have 35 colors in this wow 35 and again that's your little just thought it looked like a window on the wall at the back of a bedroom, but obviously not. So it just needs to be out for a while to flatten down this one. There you are, puppy. Put your paw on it and help me. Put that there. So let's have a look at this canvas and see what it's like. Okay, peel these up really gently so we don't get any bubbles or creases in it. It's quite a clear drill field, actually. That that's pretty good. That is pretty good. Yeah, we're, we're quite. Uh, let's see if we can focus on that. Yeah, the love hearts. There's some strange symbols there. So a couple might be a little bit harder to read than others. But I do tend to use my light pad, and I do have some glasses now. Focus. Oh, we've got a. A river there, look. Well, a crease, sorry. Not a river. Okay, let's just see. Just get him out of the way. Let's move those. Oh. Oh, let's just see if we can see. I'm not going to take this all the way off. Let's just uh, have a look. So, yeah, I'm not a huge fan of double sided tape mainly because I am quite heavy handed when I diamond paint and I also um, tend to slide my drills quite a bit which is great if you're using your poured glue but on double sided tape you tend to find that your drills don't slide and you can rook up your canvas you know that that's that's come pretty well I mean it's a bit creased on the edges but it's not creased there apart from this one here it's just got a little bit I'll have a bit of flattening that one out that should be okay but it's a nice picture I do like these with the effect of looking out of a window but as I said I was expecting it to be bigger uh, if it comes out okay I may actually get it bigger um, and it will go on the wall so yeah, let's get that covered up and just again flatten it down carefully. Keep it covered so we don't get any dust on it. Okay, I will be replacing these um, when I kit it up. Oh, I haven't done that very straight, Liz. Never mind. I'll redo that once I've got off camera. 
camera. Yeah, you can see the back of this canvas, other than this one crease here, which easily solved. You know, it's come a long way. Um, and it's pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, so let's have a look at some of the colours of these drills. I must admit, I'm, I'm impressed with the drills from the bags. Already done for you. Oh, where's the end of this? <laughs> And so it well, I'm blown away by the soak it. You don't normally get that in the, the budget end of the market canvases. Okay, so let's have a look. So look at all these blues. Wow. That's your 310. Is that 310? Oh no, it's not 310. It's 939. Look at that. It's like a purpley, blacky blue colour. But they do look quite good quality, they're not going to be any trash in there, they do look nice. 3756, that's a nice colour, I like that one. Okay, so I will check all these out later, make sure I've got them all, but look at all the different blues, there's quite a few greens. But they do look a good quality drill, I must admit, I, I am impressed. So this is craft saving that this comes from. Okay. Yeah, so look at all the different shades of blue we've got. Let's just see. Blue, 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 like a grey colour. Can't see these, can you, silly me? Blues, 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 blues. Purpley blue, blue, grey blue. There's no trash to speak of. They look really good and lovely. Little. That's like a navy blue. Another blue. Brown, grey. Brown colour. Greens. Blues. 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 Gosh, by the time I've done this one, I'll be wanting to do something with lots of pinks and bright colours in. Because this is really... Midnight Sky Blues. Okay, that's another blue. I like lots of greys. A few greenies. I suppose these are the window frames, these different colours. Okay, oh, and we've got a spare one there, look. Oh, and look, there's a red one gone for a party in that bag. Okay, so that's that one. So this is all from Craft Saving. I must admit, they've come all in really good condition. I do like them. I think I'm gonna say the tiger's my favourite. He's just gonna look stunning when he's done. So